First reading, Ezekiel chapter 28 verse 1 to 10. And the word of the Lord came to me, saying, Son of man, say to the prince of Tyre, Thus saith the Lord God, because thy heart is lifted up, and thou hast said, I am God, and I sit in the chair of God in the heart of the sea. Whereas thou art a man, and not God, and hast set thy heart as if it were the heart of God. Behold thou art wiser than Daniel, no secret is hid from thee. In thy wisdom and thy understanding thou hast made thyself strong, and hast gotten gold and silver into thy treasures. By the greatness of thy wisdom, and by thy traffic thou hast increased thy strength, and thy heart is lifted up with thy strength. Therefore, thus saith the Lord God, because thy heart is lifted up as the heart of God. Therefore behold, I will bring upon thee strangers the strongest of the nations, and they shall draw their swords against the beauty of thy wisdom, and they shall defile thy beauty. They shall kill thee, and bring thee down, and thou shalt die the death of them that are slain in the heart of the sea. Wilt thou yet say before them that slay thee, I am God, whereas thou art a man, and not God, in the hand of them that slay thee? Thou shalt die the death of the uncircumcised by the hand of strangers, for I have spoken it, saith the Lord God. Psalm, Deuteronomy chapter 32 verse 26 to 28, 30, 35 to 36. I said, Where are they? I will make the memory of them to cease from among men. But for the wrath of the enemies I have deferred it, lest perhaps their enemies might be proud, and should say, Our mighty hand, and not the Lord, hath done all these things. They are a nation without counsel, and without wisdom. How should one pursue after a thousand, and two chase ten thousand? Was it not, because their God had sold them, and the Lord had shut them up? Revenge is mine, and I will repay them in due time, that their foot may slide, the day of destruction is at hand, and the time makes haste to come. The Lord will judge his people, and will have mercy on his servants, he shall see that their hand is weakened, and that they who were shut up have also failed, and they that remained are consumed. Gospel, Matthew chapter 19 verse 23 to 30 Then Jesus said to his disciples, Amen, I say to you, that a rich man shall hardly enter into the kingdom of heaven. And again I say to you, it is easier for a camel to pass through the eye of a needle, than for a rich man to enter into the kingdom of heaven. And when they had heard this, the disciples wondered very much, saying, who then can be saved? And Jesus beholding, said to them, With men this is impossible, but with God all things are possible. Then Peter answering, said to him, Behold we have left all things, and have followed thee, what therefore shall we have? And Jesus said to them, Amen, I say to you, that you, who have followed me, in the regeneration, when the Son of Man shall sit on the seat of his majesty. You also shall sit on twelve seats judging the twelve tribes of Israel. And every one that hath left house, or brethren, or sisters, or father, or mother, or wife, or children, or lands for my name's sake, shall receive an hundredfold, and shall possess life everlasting. And many that are first, shall be last, and the last shall be first.